It's also Giving Tuesday. This is always the Tuesday after Thanksgiving uh, meant for activism to make our community better in any way that we can do so. So this can look several different ways by paying it forward, maybe giving some money to an organization or just simply spreading kindness, helping out a neighbor, giving your time. There are endless ways to lend a helping hand today. And if you want ideas, you can go to givingtuesday.org. But we have another idea for you, a nonprofit, one that embraces and strengthens families with disabilities because there is an overwhelming amount of research that shows the toll it takes on these families. So Labeled and Loved brings together caretakers of children with disabilities and Caroline Peters is joining us live with more on this nonprofit and why they're asking us to get involved, Caroline. Hey Bree, good morning. Labeled and Love was actually started by four strangers whose lives intersected because they cared for someone who had a label. Now they're on a mission to connect moms of kids with disabilities by providing experiences and resources for them, helping caretakers to avoid burnout, and by building a network of support. Families like the Mosiers here in Colorado Springs. Their daughter Faith suffers from a very rare neurological condition. Faith's mom Katie has spent years navigating her feeding, sleep, and growth complications. And Katie has pointed out it's a lot of stress and it can be isolating because she's not only the primary caretaker, but she's a wife and mother to her three children as well. Labeled in Love offers reprieve with a once a year weekend retreat. And this past year, the nonprofit chose Colorado Springs as a destination. And Katie found herself surrounded with moms who walk a similar path. You don't feel like you're sharing a piece of you that you need to hide anymore. You're feeling like you can share your story with people who get it and who aren't going to try and fix your kid, who aren't going to try and give you a solution, who aren't going to try and tell you you're wrong. They're just going to listen. According to the National Institute of Health, nearly all studies have identified parents of children with disabilities to have a 95% increased risk for depression and a 90% increased risk for anxiety. Labeled and Loved is on a mission to combat these stats and to help provide families create a safe community. So if you have the means to donate and you would like to, you can do so on the Labeled and Loved website. We do have this link to KOAA.com, but if you take a look, you can also select where exactly you want that money to go whether it's the retreat or to other resources to help these families.